Now. See anything? You think it's deserted? They've gone off with a treasure. Richard isn't going to be pleased. If there ever was a treasure. One more flight. John. I speak for Richard Lionheart, King of England. Lord of half of France, and thereby overlord of this domain. I'm up here speaking for myself. Where are your soldiers? Ran off. And the Lord of Chalouse, where is he? He led him. Ask him if he knows about the treasure. Left me here with all the women and children and no weapons any place. Here am I with only half an eye collecting arrows. And you think I've got a bow to shoot him with? <laughs> My king thinks your lord is keeping treasure from him. It's my orders to get it. Ah, that'll be the treasure people say was found by Jean the Plowman. Great gold statue, three foot long, they tell you. That's the one. Well, I was with him when we found the thing. What we dug up was a rock. Now we're fighting for a rock. You want to look? Out there in the turnip field. He couldn't lift it, so we left it lay. But what I've come to say is if there's got to be a fight, I'm all there is. So come and get me. You're a mad old man. What now? I want to give that rock to Richard. Let's find the turnip field. John. What kind of siege is this? Where is the Lord of Chalus and where is my treasure? Gone. My treasure? Gone. And the Lord is gone. Your treasure never was. A gold statue, three foot long, I want it. Captain? Yes, my lord. I ordered you to take this castle. Yes, my lord. Well, take it. Bring it down and get my statue. They surrender, and your statue is a rock. I want it done. There is no treasure. Do it. There are no soldiers in there, just some children and a mad old man. And what is that to me? Well, it should mean something. Is that disapproval, Robin? Am I in the wrong? I followed you for 20 years. I fought for you in the Crusades. I fought for you here in France. Show me a soldier, and I'll fight him now. But I won't slaughter children for a piece of gold that never was. I ordered it. I command you. You do it! You're a bloody bastard. You'll enjoy it. Damn right I'll do it. Now, get here! Now, arrest those two. Lock them up. I'll have their heads on pikes. I want these walls down, and I want every damn head in the place. John Hart. Lionheart! You are a pig! Good God! It was a stone. <sighs> a 
Is this a barber surgeon? Yes, my lord. I follow your men, sir. I only, I only look after them. Uh, with much success. Yes, I... You've seen to John and Robin. Under guard. They're on the way to Chaloux. Uh, good, good. Well, come on, come on. The patient's cold and the doctor sweats. The air will be hard to reach, sire. Oh, well, that should make it all the more worthwhile. Well, you heard it, Mocadier. I told him to attack. He told me no. I ought to kill him for it. Will you? I don't know. I'm such a moody fellow. It depends upon my mood. I killed them all this afternoon, all except the old man. I let him go. I liked his eye. But Robin? We've been friends, you see, for 20 years. I met him in Nottingham, near Sherwood, for the first time. I needed men for the crusade. Robin was the best that ever came to me. Well, get on with it. I'll die of old age at this rate. So off we went to do great things. We led 300,000 men to the Holy Land and came back on a boat. Not at all <laughs> what we intended. Christ. I do what has to be done. I have no choice. But Robin judges me. He always does. A peasant bastard. Judge a king! Oh, butcher. I'll show you how it's done. <laughs> King's blood. Remember it. cold. I don't like the dark. Cadier, how long to the town of Chalus? Half a league? Sire. A little rest, and then I'll tend to John and Robin. You tell me, killed the old man, killed the women, killed the children? What? Well, you didn't save them, did you? They are dead. We're right here. I didn't force you to come along. You looked at me. You nodded. But what do you want me to do? I oh, know. <sighs> what did I get us into? I could have talked to Richard. I could have tried. She has a bloody bastard. Are we any better? We serve him. He's our king. I took him for a great king. There we were in Sherwood, robbing abbots, giving pennies to the poor. Didn't see much compared to rescuing the Holy Land. How can you eat? I'm hungry. I reckon it's a good life to have reached 40. We have both passed it. Look at us. Oh, my poor old dad and all the dads before them lived in Barnsdale. All they ever knew was one small town. I've known a king. Traveled half the world, seen Jerusalem. Well, sand was blown in the walls for miles away, but... Well, I think I've had a good life. You think Richard will kill us? I don't know him anymore. I don't know the man. Well, if we go, we go. Is that your idea of dying? I don't know. I think I've learned and I've seen enough of it. Yeah. Tell you something. I won't go quietly. If I had 
not met you. Think what I'd have missed. King will see you now. We are celebrating our demise. I always fancied leaving from a rather larger stage, but my physician, a funny fellow, my physician, I've already had him hang. See the fair exchange. Wine? A bucket of it? But you? You're not for hanging. You're for cutting up. I would have done it already, but for this. Will that be all, my lord? All? <laughs> done, your all. All done. All over. My father cursed me when he died. I killed him and he felt resentful. He'd have loved all this. I said a bucket. A bucket! John, the next king. You remember John? John Lackland, they used to call him, but now he gets older, man. Christ, why did I have no children? Never gave a damn about England. Never really there. Not even as a corpse. <laughs> They're planting me in France! By my father! Take something. Nothing, sire. Huh? He suffers. He pouts. He gives his life to Richard and his sorrow. You don't know what sorrow is? I was a king. My mother, she'll be 80 soon, the bitch. I've sent for her. Do you think she'll come? Clever fellow, death is. I've tried to find him on my terms, and God knows I've tried. Ask for something, damn you! It's too late. There's nothing left. There's still your life. You take me as an equal. You always did. I'll carve you yet, you peasant bastard. Now carry it! My sword! While I'm still king of England, I'll... Uh... Richard. Richard. Richard, it's me. I know it's you. Free of me. I let you go. What will you do without me now, Jolly Robin? Now I'm dead.
that's that. What now? We watched him die. He saw us there. You won't mind if we miss the funeral. Where do we go? Which way? North. Why north? England's there. Let's go home, John. This way. Thorns can grow in 20 years. I know these woods. Good place to pass the night. I'm going through. What's that? Deer. Deer. <laughs> Somebody's seen us. Hmm? Come on. I can't even see you. That's the top of my tree. I told you this is the way. But there's nothing left. What would you expect to find? I don't know. I never thought that. Tuck! Tuck and well! 
And evil Prince John took one look at his sword and fled to his castle and prayed to the Lord. Follow him, follow him, bloody and brave. I'll follow bold Robin from here to the grave. Well, they've turned us into heroes, Johnny. Will, you didn't make it up. These songs, I don't know where they come from, but you hear them everywhere. So we go from town to town, then. Well, what do you do for a living? Well, I take confessions. He takes the horses. <laughs> and everywhere we go, they want to hear about the things you did. We didn't do them. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> I think I'll go to Barnsdale in the morning, see my dad. He died, John, years ago. I wouldn't have known me anyway. What happened here after we went off? Did uh, Marion... Is she still alive? The last time he passed through Nottingham. She lives down Kirkley Way, not far. Lovely girl. Haven't thought of her in years. What happened to the sheriff? Oh, he still rules the county. He's as powerful as ever. Those were good days fighting him. What about the others, the rest of us? Before they died or went away, when the Crusades were over, we were sure that you would come again. When you didn't, we took you to be dead. Like Richard. Aye, <laughs> Richard, well. I mean, King John, he must be mad. But even his own kind have turned against him, and the, the kingdom is falling apart. His queen is only 12 years old, and they say all he does all day is stay in bed with her. <laughs> <laughs> and you know he's fighting with the Pope. Can't hear mass or... Take Holy Communion anywhere in England. I mean, if ever there was a time for us, it's now. They'd come to you, Robin, the people. They'd, they'd come to you if you called them. Fight the king. Well, then why did you come back? Not to fight. Sing us another song, Will. One that really happened. About Mary. Uh, about Mary? Oh, aye, Mary and uh, Now, let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Still, it would be something, wouldn't it, Rob? Not at my age. No! attention. You and you. Any questions? Take that rope. Over there. Right. Hi. Hi. Oh, yeah. My lord, Sheriff. Yes, my lord. It's time to go. Sir Ranulph. In my domain, never tell me, always ask.
Tax is what you got from the farm and one egg be down. Um, what else for your tax? Egg. Egg. One chicken, Sam the herdsman. Oh, slow down. Oh. God. Oh. 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 Aren't we going to Nottingham? Oh, I thought we'd go by Kirkley first. <laughs> Kirkley comes this way. Aye, but Marion's up there. Up there? Oh, aye. That's Kirkley Abbey. Aye, so it is. What's she doing up there? She's lived there now for 18 years or more. None she can't be. Not by Marion. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> I won't know what to say to her. Oh, she'll think of something. This will help the pain. It's the sheriff. I have a busy day. Hello? John, you go in. I never really said goodbye. She might be angry. Better yet, leave it for another day. You there? What in hell do you want? Uh, this is Kirkley Abbey. Right you are, and I'm the abbess. Who are you? Good God, it's Marion. Run. Marion, what are you doing in that costume? Living in it. Well, I've come home to you, Marion. The wars are over. I'm here. Well, it's Mother Janet now, and you can trot right back to Jerusalem. You're angry. Not with you. I haven't thought of you in 20 years. Well, give me a smile and invite me in. Come back tomorrow. I'll be gone. The sheriff's coming for me, and I'm off to prison. Off to prison? Marion! What'd you say? Mother Janet, I... they'll be here for me soon. You're in no danger from the sheriff. You're free to carry on. But there was no services, of course, but you must help all those who come as best you can. Marion. Marion. What happened? Explain. I haven't time. Why is the sheriff coming? What have you done? God's work. That's what I do these days. If you're in trouble, I can save you. There's nothing to be saved from. I don't want you, Robin. But you've got me. I like the way you look. It's more than I can save for you. Well, this is your room. And I thought I knew you. What's happened to you? <clears throat> Good things. I work hard. I've studied herbs and medicines. I till the fields. I love my life. And I won't give it up. And when the sheriff comes... What's I... he coming for? Because I'm the abbess. And all the higher clergy's been ordered out of England by the king. And I'm not going, I'm staying. When the sheriff comes, he'll bloody well find me doing what I do. You mean to let him take you? God's with me. He was with us on the Crusades. It didn't help. Bro, horseman. Wait there. But it's my life, Robin. You're a fool. How many are they? Six. Oh, I like the odds.
My Lord Sheriff. Robin. Still not dead. Not for want of trying. Do you look well, all things considered? How was the crusade? A disappointment. After all these years, look at us. I'm nothing but a former captain. You're still the sheriff. No advancement. You see, I can read and write. It makes you suspect. Not a duke in 20 reads a word. Correct, my lord? Books are for clerks. How's Mother Janet? You find her changed? I didn't find her. She'd gone off. <laughs> Two decays I missed her by a day. Now that's odd. I sent her warning and she answered, come and get me. Well, we both come for nothing. So be it. I'm ready. Oh, I say, that's the woman, is it? It is, my lord. By my authority as... Who is this old? Sir Ralph de Pudsey. I'm your prisoner, my lord. Come back here. Let me go. Release her! Robin, aren't you ever going to grow up? I'm saving you. Arrest them all. I haven't enough men, my lord. Well, I'm here. I'll do it. You what? In King John's name, I charge you. Yield. I'm trying to. Give her to me. Here. Oh. I warned him not to. Oh. Robin, oh, for not, he serves the king. You're still a free man. Let me have her and you can go. You know I can't do that. Well, then, I shall have to hunt you down. Uh, good hunting, Sheriff. God help you, Robin. If you will. Well, that's Robin Hood. He's a dead man. Yes, but not just anyone's. He's mine. Can you get on your horse, Serrano? I didn't mean to hurt you. Nothing hurts. Oh, uh, I couldn't let them take you. Take me? I was going. I'll save you from prison. Not much I can do. It's none of your affair. I don't know how I look to you, but I'm not Joe Marion. I can't imagine living in the world again, or even for a minute wanting to. Come morning, I'm going to the sheriff. What's the sense? Who would it serve? There's always God. You went crusading, didn't you? Well, there's some things worth dying for. They had souls, too, the heathen that you killed. If I should die in prison, I'd rather not. But if it comes, it's for a reason. I'll have stood for something, but I won't have taken another life to do it. What will you do now? Fight the sheriff? More corpses? Aren't you sick of it? On the 12th of July, 1191, the mighty fortress of Bajaca fell to Richard, his one great victory in the Holy Land. He was sick in bed, never struck a blow. And on the 20th of August, John and I were standing on the plain outside of the city, watching, while every Muslim left alive was marched out in chains. King Richard spared the richest for ransoming, took the strong for slaves, and he took the children, all the children, and had them chopped apart. When that was done, he had the mothers killed. When they were all dead, 3,000 bodies on the plain, he had them all opened up so their guts could be explored for gold and precious stones. Our churchmen on the scene, and there were many, took it for a triumph. One bishop put on his mitre and led us all in prayer. You ask me if I'm sick of it. Why didn't you come home then? He was my king. Come, 
walk with me. That's where the kitchen was. And over there we stored the ale. And this? Was this our house? As small as that. The door was here. I tried so hard to keep it clean. I was right to love you all those years ago. It's odd, I know I loved you, but I can't remember how it felt or, or who I was. Of all things, I found peace most difficult to come by. I suppose I took the church up out of anger. And it's a blur now, but I think I thought that of all men, you'd mind most if I married Jesus. <laughs> Not a good beginning. For months and it was time to sleep, I think of you. All my confessions were the envy of the convent. I said endless prayers and the dreadful penance. Nothing helped at time. I have found peace. I don't dream about you anymore, Robin. I'll see you back safely into Nottingham tomorrow. I think one of my teeth is loose. Hmm? I never mean to hurt you. And yet it's all I ever do. You never wrote. I don't know how. Sleep well? Did you? Hmm. To Nottingham then? Hmm. To the Abbey first. My things were left behind. In the confusion. Well, you have to ride with me. I always did. If you still know how. Shut up at the oath. We ran and I ran the fastest, but they caught the others and they took them. They took them all away. If you'd kept out of this, they'd be here now. You believe that? You think it's you the sheriff wants? It's me. It's John and me. He's sitting in his castle, Johnny, waiting for us. Take me to Nottingham. No, no. Not you. We're going in. I'll walk there if I have to. Take them back to the camp. We'll join you there later. 
wish to God I were a man, I'd knock you down. Ah, that's my Marion. <laughs> A little bit in love with death. Flirts, he teases. I can wait. They haven't changed a thing. <laughs> One to pull, but two to push. Almost sorry. Now, at once. Aye, sir. Whoa. What now? We set up shop. You see a table? Inside all day long. What? Walk where you like. I don't understand what he means. Hey there, you lad. That's not your table. It's ours. It was empty. Makes no difference. What's mine's mine. Now get off with you. Look, I need it. I'll buy it. Not for sale. I'm good at faces. I know you don't. I. I could have sworn it. That's not your wagon. Fat man. Been here all week from Bristol. We left this morning. Be your thieves. Take the lot. 
Well, fair share, and that's too much. Listen, if you don't move, I'm going to have to split you from here to there. John. I need the ads. Now, stop exercising your talent. Madness going in there. There's only one way out. I'll bang the gate down on us. You could always come back tomorrow. Pans, sisters. There's a yellow wagon just beyond the gate. I don't think you're supposed to be here. Can you see it? We cannot lay your part, sir. We're prisoners. God Almighty, can you see the bloody wagon? You've profaned the Lord's name. Who are you? Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm a friend of Mother Janet's. And if we don't get out of here, we'll all be dead. Cut it, for Christ's sake. Move! Yeah, 
Robin Hood. Which one? Him. you better. Two old men. Jeez, oh, you sick. Two old men. This one's still alive. You take care of him. As for the rest of them, take up their limbs and bury them. You! You there! Raise it! Raise the gate! Count, my lord. Oh. I ought to let you go. I'll bring him back. Bring him back from Sherwood. You won't even find him. I can do it. In full armor in the woods. You'll sink up to your armpits in the bogs. I've tried it. I've got in after him. I never even saw his archers. Just the arrows in my soldiers' bodies. I can get him. And you failed. And you don't like it. All right. Get some men. Raise the gates. Thank you. 
never did have the touch for driving. Oh, you all right? Think they'll come after us? We'll hear from Will in good time if they do. Oh, are you all right? Oh. There's not another mother oh. abbess like you in the world. Oh. Hey, Amen to that. You're Your face. Mom. Blood. Blood. Was this a day? I haven't had one like it since we left. Neither have I. Did we really used to do this sort of thing? All the time. Uh, not there. Oh. Oh, Robin. When I saw you on that wall, I thought I saw you dead. <laughs> Why did I ever leave? Uh, let's take a look at you. Oh, just a few bumps, well, all the bruises. Same. They're all the same. Oh. Mm. oh. So many. You had the sweetest body. Hard and not a mark. And you were mine. When you left, I thought I'd die. I even tried. I walked out in the woods not far from camp and lay down by a stream and cut myself. Some damn fool forest that came by and took me to the abbey, so they say. No more scars, Robin. It's too much to lose you twice. I've never kissed a member of the clergy. Would it be a sin? Need your bow. Right. Oh. Uh. Hasn't there been enough for one day? I won't be long. I'll meet you back at camp. Don't go. I just want to look. See who's hunting me.
Oof. Next time you ride into Sherwood, keep your visor down. John. Wait. Quote. I hold my office from the king himself. I never liked your king much. You're his subject. And his servant. He's not king here. Not in Sherwood. You're the ruler, are you? Should I bow? I wouldn't have you in my service, nobleman. I've known your kind all my life. You're everything I meant to fight. You're the enemy. You gobble good red meat, and we get bread and cheese. The laws can't touch you, and there's no crime you can be punished for. And we can shoot a deer and have our eyes put out. This is my forest. I'll live here as I like. You come in again, I'll kill you. Good. Was there fighting? Some. You promised you were only going to look. Christ. My father worked an honest day for 30 years and left behind an iron pot, a blanket, and a bloody spoon. The sheriff? No, the oath. Didn't kill him. No. I told him this was my forest. It's all I want. I want to live here with you. What are you looking for? Some trace of Marion or Mother Janet. Either one. Good woman, Janet. Years of diligence it took to leave the flesh behind, but she achieved it. She could look at men and feel nothing. See, she looks at you. Touch her hand. Hold it. Just as well. She wouldn't feel anything. Think of what I did, and it makes no sense. To want to die from wanting you. Some other girl it must have been. Let me hold you. Robin. Were there many women? on your great crusade. Watch. Don't tell me. As you wish. How many? Well, uh, but they all looked like you. Smiling. 
I don't mind. Could there be two rooms to our house next time? Hmm. And something for a floor. All right. I'd like that. And a bed with blankets? Yeah. And a chest for clothes and... You hear that? Jesus Christ Almighty! Don't! You do be rubbing up, don't you? Oh, I'll be damned. <laughs> I told him in the market it was you. It's Robin, lad. I told you so. Robin's back in Sherwood, I said. And I let him because I knew the way. They're mostly from farms round about here. They're here to serve you, Robin. And fight against that king. Chuck. Hey. Give them all food. Oh. <clears throat> I'm going to feed it. So be it then. Go fight the sheriffs and the kings. I love you and you make me proud. But if there were a way to turn time back just five minutes, I'd give my soul to do it. Where is the king? In the largest tent, of course. <laughs> so, you go to the Pope and you tell him if his archbishop puts one foot in England, I'll cut his goddammit head off! What next? John? Aren't you ever coming? Soon. I clean all over. Want to look? Cool to see you. I don't mind. I think you're pretty. What in God's name do you want? Men, Majesty. Two hundred men. Two hundred? For God's sake, what for? To fight an enemy, my lord. What enemy? There are so many. Robin Hood. I thought the man was dead. He's back in Sherwood. Can't the sheriff manage it? I mean, you waste my time. I'm a common chief. My army waits for me in Dover, and I'm off to France in the morning. Good God, man. But, sire, these people, they've made a hero out of him. They're flocking to him in hundreds. He's become a legend. Have you ever tried to fight a legend? Just my brother. But, sire, they mean to rise against you. Do they? Do they? Be in Dover in the morning. I'll give you what men I can. And you tell the sheriff. I'll have Robin's head. Or I'll have his. Either way, I'll win.
sure these fairies make it clean. Right, you keep your forearm straight and you pull it back to your chin, right? Like that. Which arm? All right. This is two. Sends a message. He wants Robin's head. Oh, mine. Follow me. These troops were put under my command. Not in my county. Follow me. This way! Close enough. Rob? Yeah? How many? Enough. And they're making camp. They're in the field. I thought they were coming after us. They all come. Will! Chuck! What's wrong? Sheriff's out there with an army, 100 soldiers, maybe more. And good ones from the look of them. Where are they? They're making camp near Kirkley. They'll be coming in after us at dawn. I want us in position by tonight. are absolutely delicious. Damn this thing. You're still eating breakfast. Still? What are you waiting for? More men. I think I had enough. What do we do? We wait and see. Oh, 
Come on, come on. What? What happened? Nothing. Nothing? We attacked. No one followed us. And we're supposed to leave the woods and fight them in the open? That <laughs> seems to be the plan. We'd be slaughtered. Does he think we're fools? That's what he's waiting for. I know it. Well, he's the fool, then. He can sit out there forever. He can't put a forest under siege. Will? Well, that's how I see it. If he comes in, we've got him. Chuck? We stay here. The man's mad. You haven't asked what I think. I think one mad man's enough. He's out there, Marion. He expects me. Let him. Mr. Ryder. You look so cold. So beautiful, this place. The woods just now, full of noises. Everything's so alive. I kept thinking, I don't know, of all the death I've seen. I've hardly lost a battle, and I don't know what I've won. The day is ours, Robin, Richard used to say. And then it was tomorrow. But where did the day go? You're so beautiful. Come and sit by me. You love me. Say it. What's the matter? Nothing. You're going, aren't you? It's a possibility. You've heard John. And Will and Tuck, they all said it was madness. Well? Is that all being dead means, well? I'll have a lot more to say when the time comes. Well, let it be God's time. He'll take you soon enough. And it's all in his hands. You think I'm old. Grey and old. Well, I'm not. Oh, Robin. I'd be 20 for you if I could. I'm all I ever was. You show me on the wall. Come back, there'll be another morning, won't there? Another. And each time you'll be less. Not Robin anymore. And then one day... You'll see. No, I won't see. Or hear the songs about bold Robin. I'll be gone. Leave? Why? Because I'll do everything for you but mourn. Go fight your sheriff. And may God go with you. May the sun shine and the day be great. Robin, I never want to know. Goes if he never found me. They stop him from this thing. What thing? Don't let him march you out against the sheriff. What? Didn't he tell you? 
by the sheriff. Don't be mad, it's 41 against. We'll be slaughtered. What's he thinking? These are boys we've got. They're farmers. Tell him you're the only one. He'll listen. Me? Say no to Rob? Just this once. We've always been together. Been nothing without him. But I want him safe. That's all I said I'd leave here. What more do you want from me? I haven't asked for anything. You never liked me much. You're Rob's lady. Go on, say it. You're Rob's lady. If you'd been mine, I never would have left you. You decided what? It's mad, Rob. And? Well, I thought that you'd be lost without me. <coughs> this could be the hardest part of the day. I doubt it. God keep you well. If he so chooses.
man. Just for you. I know. I want to settle this with champions. One of your men against mine? The winner takes the day. Why should I, Robin? The odds are four to one. Why should I make them even? I'm one champion. Ah. And I'm the other. If I lose, my men are yours. Without me, they won't trouble you. They'll go home again. And if I lose? Your soldiers leave the field. Those are my orders. They're clear? I let this rabble go. Just march away. Those are my orders. Leave the field. I promised I'd watch out for you. I promised her. She's gone. In any case. I'll kill him, Rob, if you don't. No. What you do is keep my word. See you, Johnny. Off you go. God be with us, Robin.
I couldn't stop him. I did the last of you. A woman of your world, eh? <laughs> I'm glad you came back. Is this? No one rings the hours. Are you in great pain? Huh? Oh, I'm too weary. I've had worse. He went down well, Sheriff did. Brave man. And the battle won today. The years, the years they whittle at you. I should give it up, you know. I doubt I'll have a day like this again. And yet... Hmm? John. Oh. Is 
they should follow us. I'll oh, wait outside. I did my best. I know. gentler in the world. No, half is terrible. Did you see him? <laughs> I should go and tend my men. Brave boys, all of them. I meant it. I like your medicine. There's no pain at all. time in the forest. You'll tend me till I'm well again. And then, great battles. We'll have a life to sing about. Uh, legs are cold. I know. And now, What have you done? John! You're poisoned! Help me! No one can help you now. Jesus, Marion. and morning prayer, so peace, so oh, oh, food to eat. Oh, I love you more than sunlight, more than flesh or joy or oh, one more day. I love you. Never have a day like this again, would I? It's better this way. This falls, John. We're just close. <laughs> 